What? Tighten it up. Let's start the air system. Let's check it all out. See what's going on. And then, uh, <laughs> they probably didn't want to work on it anymore, huh? Tighten it up. Let's see what's going on. You gotta kind of air it up to see how high it goes. Man, they like spray painted everything. Like, I don't understand why they did that. They put an air tank here, right here. So we're gonna put a, the E-level tank. It's got the solenoids already built in inside. So we're gonna take off this one. Yeah, it's all good. Yeah, it's all good. Yeah, it's all good. Yeah, it's yeah, you told me about that. He wants two grand. Yeah, two jeans? Maybe, yes. Yeah. Money tax, you know? Money tax, coach, you what? Oh, there we got these things installed. That's cool. Before you have to install them yourself. That's awesome. This one has the solenoids inside. And they don't get wet inside. No wet oh, they, they the seal. They seal. Measure it. Where's the tape measure? Where's the tape measure? Tape measure, tape measure. Let's see if we got enough space. 30 inches. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's not gonna fit. Oh shit. What do you think? Let's take this, yeah, let's take this one off. Come on, stop fucking around. Get some tools. Uh, half inch, got a feel of inch? Yeah, socket with the impact and a wrench. Okay. That's a 916, okay. cabrón. Why are you doing me like that? Jeez, got a feel Are you awake on me or what, dog? Alright. Oh no, this is gonna be a little nightmare right here. Oh fuck. Sin la extensión. Mira. ¿Cuál quieres? ¿El de arriba o el de abajo? Ah, we need a swivel. ¿Otro? ¿Ya se fue? ¿Otro? ¿Ya se fue? 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 ¿Ya se <laughs> How long is this fucking boat? Jesus, dude. Oh, we got it. Take it out. You got it? Yeah. Fucking thing weighs like a ton. Better? Oh, fuck. Oh, no, it's metal up here. Metal up here. This way. Oh, there. 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 Oh, I gotta take measurements, cabrón. Okay. <sighs> Holy smoke! Four and a half. We could do four inches. Four inches. So we could do a three inch high, one inch. Let's see. Yep. Uh, three quarters of an inch. Three quarters, three quarters, three quarters, two inch, three quarters. Alright, let's do it.
Tú sabes, loco. So we make these brackets. We're gonna bolt these brackets down right here. We're gonna drill a hole right here. Right? Then we have one. Oh, shit, got a pillar. Yeah, got a pillar, you're fast, though. Thank you, bro. Let's <laughs> see. So but then we make this bracket to this side. And then we're gonna make a plate across that bolts this one up. I could have made it all in one piece, but it'd be taking me a little longer because we gotta figure out all the dimensions. But this way it's gonna look cool too. Plus, I made it adjustable. Ow, ow. That way we can move it back and forth. <clears throat> What's for lunch? You ain't hungry? No, but I'm not sure. What are you thinking? I don't think. Yes, not. Sure, we gotta take it off to paint it anyway. It's just to get the measurements. Fuck, everything takes fucking days and shit to do. Later. Well, it's just to hold it right now, anyways. We'll get the right ones. It's just to hold it up. We'll put the correct ones when we put it together. It bothers me, I just want to let you know, loco. It bothers me when you bring me a long one and a short one. Just to let I you know. know. You like the long ones. <laughs> I want some water, dude. I'm already hungry. Shorty like it. Shorty? 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 Four and a half. See, this is why I don't like these big tape measures. Look, I can't even fit this in here, bro. Al revés. Go give me the other one, cabrón. Ahora sí. it in and put the bolts right here and fucking zap them. What do you think? Simon? Hell yeah, that's what I like to hear, homie. What's for lunch? What's for lunch? So look, we'll bolt it up to here and then when we put it on with the bracket, we just slide it in. Boom, pop, pop, pop. Cool. Yeah? I don't think you can slide it in. What do you mean you don't think? Oh yeah, it's got to go yeah. sideways, huh? That's all right. So we got 20, 25 and a half. Look, the bracket, it tapers. It's not completely straight, it tapers in. So it's a quarter inch wider on the bottom. That's a good thing we checked, no? Yep, it's exactly a quarter inch. It's 25 and three quarters. Yes, sir. Yes. What about the hole? Yes, sir. 
Wow. We gotta plug them up. That's why we got all the plugs. We gotta get it ready. While we're getting that ready, we're gonna uh, paint this. Yeah. But look how it's hot. Let it cool down. Don't paint it like that. Let it cool down. Alright, Peachy, what it was for lunch, homie. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> What's for lunch, dog? Yeah, I gotta go get a pet car. Pet car can feed me? It goes right here, cabrón. No, you put a mark on it? Yes, I put a mark on it. Oh, shit. This is the right one. Right, right. This is 516 nuts, so we can put this on. We can put it on the top or the bottom. Where do you want to put it at? Donde te guste más. Where you like it the best? Yeah. <laughs> Made it adjustable, see that? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Who's your daddy? <laughs> Everything's adjustable now. Anybody want to buy a bracket and fit a 1949 to 53 to fit your uh, hey, eco tank? Let me know what's cracking. So, those are so luck. They don't know something to do real. Nice. It's gonna fit fucking feet, man, homie. I said for good guys. Homie. I want this to be for the cochones. Con la you hear what I said? Mm -hmm. Nice is for good guys. Firmes for the cochones. <laughs> I'm just fucking around. A ver, a ver, como lo metes, a ver. We'll see, you'll see right now. Ready? Vamos, let's see. Here we go. Make sure I'm putting it in the right direction. This way. Like this? No, you gotta put it there. Ah, I see you, right? Yeah, yeah, I think I can pick that one. Oh, wait, wait. Who's your daddy? Who's your daddy? Oh, we gotta take one side off. We almost got it. We almost got it, homie. Ready? Bring the bracket. Oh, here's you. How come we only have one light right here? Go for it. The other one took a shit. Oh, look at that. Come on, Vato! Ah, man, why you leave me hanging right here in front of the camera, homie? Ah, uh, but the other one. Oh, shit, this shit got heavy, dude. Whew! Yeah, yeah. What is that? Oh shit, remember that shit in the cruising days? That's 90s. No, that's fucking 80s, fool. Remember, remember that shit? Remember that? On yeah. oh, Highland? See or no? See? Did you play this or what'd you play? Fuck, I'm uh, making everybody run from the yeah? sidewalk. Uh, Why? This. Yeah, the ladder roof, system? No, the rooster tail is uh, scraping. You were scraping? Yeah. Fucking go for the door. Así, wey. Hasta la banqueta, no pinches. No, pinche. no, <laughs> no mames, wey. You don't look high, like uh, the type, homie. You don't look like the type. Fuck, wey. I only did it a couple of times, and then a friend of mine, he said, let me use the car. I want to scrape it. So I said, go ahead. It's the last time I did. My gas tank was sitting in the back, you know, 70. Yeah. It's in the back and almost by the bumper. Scrape it? 
scrape the style? I uh, know. I seen it was covered and, and fire. Hey, man, I said, fuck, and I'm driving the motorbike. <laughs> the last time I did that shit. What kind of car was it? The 70. The 70 Impala? Yeah. Wow. That was like brand new back in the day, though, huh? Brand new. You had a brand new? Brand new. I got it from Lynn Chevrolet. Mm -hmm. It's the one they hit on the window there. <laughs> we need a lock washer. You got one? No, but I can yeah. Three I grand. <laughs> hey, three grand. <laughs> I got the, the Impala. Did you hit? Out of the uh, showroom floor? Showroom floor. No way. For yeah. three grand? Three grand. Oh, yeah. wow. Boom. Oh, how, can can I, how much is it? How much is an Impala now? Like 30, ah. 50 grand? Well, you, I all fucked that one. <laughs> Not, even. <laughs> Not even a new one, huh? Off the showroom floor. All right, get a half inch, uh, 716 with the impact. You see how this is going to work out. Ooh, if it's fucking feed me on here, bro. We're going to have to put a little sticker on there. Everybody thought I was crazy because I put hydraulics in the Somebody set. thought you were crazy? A week later. Yeah, she got up with it. This is a half inch? Yeah. Where's the 716? Huh? You got it? A huevo. 49 through 53, let me know. Eco tank, homie. Oh, Fit right underneath the fucking stab. You can hide it. I can see me the chingon. This thing is a baby to press. No baby compressor. Oh, man, we can put it back where it was before. That's not a bad spot. It's just they, they caged it up with that cage on there. What's up? Did it come off? Yeah. Not even good primer. Fuck. <laughs> Check it out. Let's put the compressor back, back over here where it was. But we'll make something better than what they had. Like that, that uh, little box. Where's the little box at? Woo. Where's the little box, Carapilla? I mean, it's not bad. It's made out of aluminum. They just fucking painted it. We just can't get to the bolts. What do you think? Should we leave it? Bolt holes. You know what I'm thinking about doing? Because check it out. If this dude drove this car in the rain. This would get filled up with water, and the water won't even drain out. You know what I'm saying? There's no air flowing through here very much. See? So if water's in here, the compressor goes in there. That, that means this would have filled up with water, bro. No bueno, right? So what we'll do is we'll make one out of like. We'll make a bracket, that way we'll be able to see it and get to it a lot easier. Oh yeah, Mike, ¿y aquel lado no te queda mejor en el punto con el tanque? Todo. Where, where, ahí, where, like ahí, right here in this little ahí. spot right here? Yeah. All right, let me see. I see you don't have to run shit. Are you all done with it? No, todavía le falta ahí. Aquí. Closer to the tank, tank A? Closer to the tank A? Yeah, the tanks? No que tanto, que Let's here. bring it from yeah, here. Bring it from here. Alright, a little stick, homie. A little stick. Let's see it. So what we're gonna do is mount it right here. So you see right here, we're gonna go. There's a hope. We're gonna, there's a flat, flat spot here, flat spot here. We'll go around like this, this way, like this. And then we'll break it to the sides, come over this way, and then come down like that. So it'll be bolted like right here. Just like that. Are you happy, Carapila? You happy? Oh, so man, of course. All right. Check this out. See this right here? See this? Uh -huh. We gotta flatten it out. You got the flapper wheel? We're gonna, we're gonna run the, the bracket like this. So we got... Uh, one inch.
tempo a profecia. Homem na tempo a profecia. Você já lê isso? Não, já. Não é? Que é meu pé. Oi, tem. Se bom? Some lights underneath here, you can't see shit. Got a pila! What are you doing, cabrón? We'll drill a hole here, so we'll mount it right there. Boom! I broke it right here, we did a little slot, broke it here, we'll weld this right here. We weld this little slot, see that? And then the compressor sit right there. Bring the compressor. Look for Sean. There it is. We'll bolt it right here, see that? Uh huh. Let's paint it. You don't need to put it way over here, bro. We can leave it inside the fucking shop. I know. I don't want to get over spray on the car. Uh, we've been spraying all kinds of shit over there, bro. <laughs> Let me get some bolts, bolt this down, and then we're gonna bolt it back on the frame. So hold it up there while I'm bolting it down, because Pinchy got a beat that didn't show up to me. I'm getting ready to wire up the indoor tank so I can be able to race the car up and down so I can do the E-level uh, brackets. It's better like when you can race the truck up and down, go up and down so you can test the E-level brackets and everything that I'm going to have to make for that. So I'm getting ready to wire it up but I just realized that we have to make another bracket because that's what we do. Nothing but brackets around here for the the ECU for the ELEP. When a lot of people are thinking, oh, can you mount that outside? Of course you can. You can mount it anywhere you want. It, it has a weatherproof, uh, you know, seals on the connectors. If you look at every connector, you see this? See, it has like weatherproof, these seals. The ECU also has them inside too, you know? So it doesn't have to be inside. You can put it outside. So I was looking at the wiring because these go into the indoor tank. It has two plugs on each side, one plug on each side. So each plug is for like four, two valves, you know, I think four valves. And then on this side, it's another four valves. So we got to put the ECU where it's like convenient for either side. All right, so we're going to find a good spot to mount the ECU, which we want it close to the tank we're not worried about all this wiring harness over here that goes to the car I mean it all goes to the car but this one goes to the brake lights and other stuff and this one we're gonna be wired so we'll put the best bet is probably if we can 
mount it somewhere here. Make it look like, like a little bracket. Let me see. There's a bolt down right here and the bolt down right here. We can go like this. Make the bracket come back, sit down right here, and we can just bolt it like that. I think that's what we're gonna do. You know what I mean? That's easy access. Gotta do a small little teeny break right here. But, you know what I mean? Like that, see? Yeah. Oh shit, fuck, fucked up. Ta da! but perfection. Shake it up, just like that. So I'm gonna wire up the earth system. That way we can uh, test the, the the brackets on the on the sensors in each corner so they all work properly. So we can air up the car and go up and down. So let's let's wire that up. Oh, we gotta put this sensor in. Let's put this in. Wire up the compressor and the tank all together, you know? What's this? This is the air sensor, the air pressure sensor. This is to, it sends a signal to the compressor when to turn on and when to, when to turn off. He smoke Billy Lang? <laughs> Billy Lang. We'll run the airline like this. It's gonna come out this way. For white and black, four up. So that's the rear. This is the rear. This is the front. Run it through the back. Let me see. Yeah, it's gonna reach. It's gonna be cool. This is gonna go to the ECU. So let me see. Yep. So I'm gonna heat, heat, heat shriek wrap it. So it's all clean, you know. Alright. I'm gonna run it right here. Sit tight right here. And then we'll come around the back, right here. You won't even see it, bro. Man. Let's 
So we're gonna do this, like this, this, like this. Oh man, this is gonna be perfection, dog. So we're gonna tap into them like this. We'll chop it right here. Oh shit, here we go. Here we go, let's start wiring it up our chingon, because that's the only way I know how to do it though. <laughs> Woo! We're gonna run this one like this, like that. Come this way. The only way I know how, dog, the chingon way, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Plug it in. This is for the the E level. The sensors that go in every corner. Use some zip ties. This goes right here. probably do it coming off the bottom here up Every time, homie, every time. <laughs> I built this little bracket so we can mount our uh, stuff here, relay, you know what I mean? And then we'll make a little box to cover it, but we'll do that later. Right now, what we're gonna do is wire it up, make sure everything works and stuff. Mount it, get everything situated, and then we're painting. A little warm today, bro. I bet you got a pila sticking in the AC. This day off and shit. Yeah, so pretty. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put these, we'll mount them here, like that, and then we'll put the relay on this side. Like that. That'd be like our mounting area. Instead of like, you know, mounting it in some random places. Ah, yeah. Nice little panel. You gotta 
run power from the battery. power wire to the compressor but I'm gonna heat wrap it that way it doesn't look all bare running across the the frame size of the airline because it already has the fittings for a quarter inch drive. The airlines are like all ugly and short. We're gonna leave the fittings, we're gonna run new airlines, the fittings are fine. What we'll do with airlines, run it through here.
grip pads and shit. I'm gonna be sneaky about it and shit. <laughs> Somebody's, Lord, I don't know why would they spray shit all under, on top of everything. Like, <laughs> this is water trap. When the compressor sends air to the tank, and then a water trap in between for condensation. Because the compressor creates moisture. And you don't want moisture going into your tank because, you know, try to stop as much as it goes in there. It doesn't create a, a lot of moisture, but every now, every, every now and then, it just depends how long you drive the car, you want to release some of that moisture out, you know. So we're going to put it here, be able to reach underneath here and just kind of touch it with his hand. It doesn't take much, all you do is just press on this and the water comes out. So it's kind of like weird area down here, so we're gonna make this. We'll do an inch and a quarter. You gotta be careful when you tighten these guys because you can easily snap this. Not for him, <laughs> not for the people. Uh, yeah, uh, the. Uh, Uh, you think it's good or what? Huh? Is it good right here? Uh -huh. Okay, see what's that stick? I can't get in there. It's too long. It's too long. Oh, you fucking smart motherfucker, dude. Carapila! When did you realize you, you were all smart, dude? <laughs> Did you realize you were smart as soon as you were born? Or was it something you figured out as time was going on like Superman? underneath the running board and push that and let the air out. outside in case the compressor malfunctions so if the compressor goes out it stops working you always got access to put air in the tank 
so you can raise your car up. A safety feature. 